welcome to another channeled guidance from the Wild Mystic Oracle. And I don't know who this is for, but the croc came out and it's the Patience card. This card represents patience and consideration. Crocs are ambush predators and their strategic strategy involves waiting and educating prediction. They observe the habitat of their prey and monitor watering holes and strike only when ready. This card is a symbol of careful judgment and deliberation. It urges you caution and warning against impulsive decisions and advises you to weigh your options. The presence of the croc in your reading might also indicate that there is no easy answer to your question or that whatever you're deliberating will be a complex decision. Associated with water serpents and sea monsters, this mystical, mythical croc has a fearful reputation. Crocs have been revered by many cultures in the world over from ancient Egypt God Sobak to the crocodile guardian of Goan people of Adulism. Their prehistoric appearance and slow predatory style leading to explosive and devastating attacks make them similar to a shark in many ways. In Indonesia, a popular myth sees a shark and croc battle each other with the shark taking control of the water and the croc the land. The croc is more defined and corporal problems that can be solved rather than one of the mind. So a shadow reading. Why hunting the croc seems placid, it is still on the surface of the water. This patient predator bides its time before ultimately attacking. The shadow reading of the croc card may caution you not to become stagnant due to indecisions, but sometimes decisive action must be taken to seize your prey. It may also read as a guidance not to push somebody's patience too far. Correspondence element of earth and water, because they can go in earth and water. Uh, stones, blue lace, agate, obsidian, and aquamarine. And spell work is promoting coming to promoting coming to a decision, uh, promoting patience, a positive outcome of a judgment. So let me know if you resonate with this. This may be for you. You may need to hear this message. It came out of the blue, and I was like, holy crap. So um, let me know in the comments. Much love. Blessed be.